So there's a risk of uh, putting the Amazon forest into a, a state where it could go past the a tipping point, uh, leading towards dieback, but it's quite complex and it's about an interaction between climate change, drying out the climate and heating the regional climate, but also deforestation as well. Uh, so the, uh, the drier climate obviously makes the forest more vulnerable to drought and forest fires and so on. Deforestation also brings in extra risk of fires from people using fires to cause deforestation and also as the forest is fragmented from deforestation it gets more vulnerable for drying around the edges. These two things together uh, could act to take the Amazon past the point of no return at some point. But the good news with that is that if, it's, if deforestation is a more direct human action we have a more immediate chance of stopping it by holding back on deforestation.